What is up guys? As you can see, I am in a prisoner outfit and that's because we're gonna be eating prison food for the next 24 hours. There's a TikTok account that's actually run by a former prisoner and he shows you the types of meals that prisoners would make when they would get hungry. So you know it's authentic. We're gonna be following the recipes and eating prison food for 24 hours. Hope you guys enjoy. For our first meal of the day, we're gonna start off with a prison grilled cheese. Okay. And what you're gonna need is an iron, butter, bread, aluminum foil, and cheese. If you guys are wondering how you get an iron in jail, the actual guy responded to a comment saying that you could buy it from a commissary worker. So there are ways. Let's get started. I hope you guys can take me serious with this outfit on the whole video. I just want to get in the spirit, you know? So we're gonna take some aluminum foil. You're gonna lay it down like that. You're gonna grab two pieces of bread. Next up, you're gonna take a butter knife and you're gonna spread the butter on the outside of the bread. I just wonder if it's actually gonna taste different with an iron or, I don't think it's gonna taste different. I think it's gonna come out the exact same as if you made it on the stove. It's more of like a DIY, you know, like yeah. more innovative. So now that we got the butter spread, we got the cheese. I put it right here. And then we're gonna put the other piece like that. Butter's still on the outside. He said that you only wanna have one layer over. So you don't wanna double it like this. But now, the fun part. I've never used one of these. According to D, you're supposed to put this for about two minutes. Maybe like move it around a yeah. little, you know? Yeah. I don't know why, I'm a huge fan of these videos. So if you guys love these creative food videos, drop a like. All right, now we're gonna flip it on the other side and do the same thing. Two minutes, baby. All right, just like that. You ready to see the finished product? Oh. What? Um, <laughs> oh, it's hot, it's hot, it's hot. Hold up, let's see if it actually cooked. Oh yeah. The inside cooked, the outside. Wait, so did we do it right? Does it look the same as these? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> but he's, he's like a pro, you know, like this is a, ah! It's hot, it's hot. Let it sit for a little bit if you guys are gonna try this. Let it sit. <laughs> Just let it sit, it's kind of windy outside. It doesn't matter about how it looks, it matters about how it tastes. Okay. So let's give it a shot. Yo, that kind of looks good. All right, pet, go. <laughs> it's like a regular grilled cheese. It's alright. Right. <laughs> I think the bread needed to cook a little bit more. We need to collab with D. He mm -hmm. needs to come down here and teach us how to do this thing. I'm gonna give this a rating of 5 out of 10. I'll say a 3. Alright, well, let's continue. Come on, hop in. Hop in. Yes, sir. How did you get this Lambo? Is this yours? Don't ask any questions. Okay. Hop in. Okay. Imagine someone who doesn't know who I am sees me wearing this in a Lambo. Are they calling the cops or not? 100%. Okay, let's be honest. I don't look like I would go to prison, you know? Do I? Guys, I am here with Jay! We're about to make prisoner burrito. Wait, that didn't make sense. <laughs> a prisoner burrito. <laughs> so what you're gonna need is some Cheez-Its, a bag, some ramen, jerky, burritos, Cheetos, a towel, and a plate. And you are gonna need some hot water. Junior, have you ever had a prison burrito? Cause I feel like you've been there before, right? I've been to prison, yeah, but um, Not I just ate like regular meals. Like from the cafeteria? Yeah, yeah. This... Okay, this is more DIY. Yeah, get creative, bro, what are you doing? The ingredients concern me. I know, you guys are probably wondering <laughs> how this is gonna turn into a burrito. Burrito, but let's show you. First, you crush the ramen. Then you're gonna pour all the contents of this ramen in this Ziploc bag. Junior, give me a hand. Oh, I got there, yeah. Next, you're gonna crush your Cheetos. It should look a little something like that. And you're gonna pour this with the ramen. This is about to be a fire burrito. Next, you're gonna do the same with Cheez-Its. Then you're gonna pour the Cheez-Its in the ramen Cheetos mixture we already have going. Good nice, pour, good nice. pour. So maybe like around that much. But wait, there's more. You're gonna take the flavor from the ramen that you have. It could be beef or chicken, and then you're gonna pour that in there. Perfect. You're still not done with this bag. You're gonna take the beef jerky, and you're gonna cut it into pieces, and then you're gonna put that in the bag as well. Now that you got it looking like this, you pour this in the bag. Ooh, oh, dropped one. This is what it's supposed to look like before you add the hot water. Now it's time to add the boiling water and you don't want to add a lot. Be nice and slow with it. I think that should be good. Then you're gonna seal it up. You're gonna want to smash it up a bit and it should look a little something like that. That's what the consistency is supposed to look like. And then you are going to want to roll this to compress everything to the bottom like that. So you just wrap it in a towel like this and D said that you have to wait about 15 minutes for it to cook and we should be good to go. So while we let this cook, you're gonna take your honey barbecue Fritos. It could be any honey barbecue, honey Cheetos, honey anything. Take it, you're gonna crush it. Not like we haven't done this five times so far, but I'm gonna pour this in the plate. I should have crushed it. 
crushed it more, but this is where you're gonna wrap your burrito in. You think it's time to check it out? It's been about 10, 15 minutes. Please work. Come on, come on. All right. Yo, that smells good. It smells like pizza. It actually does, it's so weird. So some of it might fall apart because we didn't add enough water, but see, Junior, you can get this part. Okay, that still counts. Oh yeah, we made two burritos. Yeah, exactly. Two perfect. burritos, it kind of fell apart. I feel like it's actually gonna taste good, low key. This is my burrito. It shouldn't have come out like this, but cheers. cheers. Here we go. It's all right. The texture is weird, but the taste is actually good. I agree, the texture is just not good, but you literally just taste everything we put in. Wow. Noah, here you go. Thanks, Jake. Good. That's like a 10 out of 10. I'm still eating it, so that means it's good. I'm gonna go like a 7.5. You know, times are tough in prison. Having this, I'd say like a 8.5. I like that. Good. Well, guys, we got some more meals on the way, so stick around. All right, next up, I'm here with Chanel. Hey, guys. And we're gonna be making some prison Laffy Taffies. Have you seen this on TikTok? No, never. What you guys are gonna need is some powdered creamer of your choice, some Kool-Aid of your choice, and water. That's all you need to make Laffy Taffy, which is crazy. You're gonna start with the powdered creamer in here. Next, you add the Kool-Aid packet. Ooh, perfect. So gray. I know, I didn't realize it was gray. Now what you're gonna wanna do is actually mix this before adding the water. So the key to this is you barely add water, like a tiny bit of water as you guys saw on the TikTok. So like that much. This part is what's gonna take long. You have to actually mix it for 30 minutes. It's starting to already look different. We're gonna try to do this until we get the taffy consistency and that's where the fun part happens. It smells like it. It smells so good. Oh my gosh. I think we definitely put the right amount of water. We just have to keep stirring, stirring, stirring. Is there a way we could cheat this? Follow me. Oh, really? Wait, so you think this will work? Let's give it a go. So hold on, hold on. let me just say something. In prison, you're gonna we have to use have your this. hand, but we have a live hack because Chanel has to go to work. So hopefully it works. Ooh, that's definitely gonna speed up the process. It kind of looks like taffy already. How does it feel? It's mushy. Like Play-Doh? Yeah, Play-Doh, exactly. D said you have to keep doing this until you get a better Laffy Taffy consistency, and then we could try it. So what he uses the saran wrap for is to roll it out and then cut it into pieces, because he said in prison, you could sell three pieces for a dollar. That's the hustle make right money there. there. Right? This is legit Laffy Taffy. So now Chanel is rolling it out so we could cut it into little pieces. So ours doesn't look as good as his, but we're trying, okay? All right, you want to cut it? I'll cut, I'll cut, I'll yeah, cut. Yeah, yeah, wait, can we both cut it? Yeah, ready? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Should we try a piece? All right, three for a dollar, guys. Hit me up, Just DM me on Instagram or something. <laughs> it's time for I'm the so taste scared. test of the Laffy Taffy. I'm only gonna take a bite. Same here. All right, ready? Yep. Cheers. I'm a bit it's sour. So sour. I'm a little bit, a little bit sour. <laughs> It tastes like a Laffy Taffy. We just didn't have the time. What made it so sour? The Kool-Aid powder. I think we should have added a little bit more powdered creamer, but what? it's really good. It's actually really good. I could taste the Laffy Taffy. Noah, you already know. Might as well. Wow, it's, it's sour. <laughs> it's not bad though. It's, it's really, not bad at all. It's really good. It's actually really good. All right, good luck at work, Chanel. Thank you, bye guys. We'll see you with the last meal. So for our last meal, we are gonna be making some prison pizza with Jessica. It's been a while. These are all the ingredients you need. You wanna list them with me? Cheese it. Salsa. Water. Cheese. Pepperoni. Beef stick. Cheese. Ramen. Pickles. I'm a little iffy about the pickles. And this too. This is what you're gonna make your dough in. Mm -hmm. And then you need something circular to flatten out the dough and make it round. Let's get started. So Dee made it with saltine crackers, but me and Jessica love Cheez-Its, so we're gonna replace the saltine crackers with Cheez-Its. You can make it with saltine, Cheez-Its, whatever you wanna do. We're gonna start by crushing some Cheez-Its. Wait, why don't we just do them all in one? Like, whatever we have to crush. So yep. even the okay, ramen. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Put the ramen in. All right, we're doing some live hack here. Wait. Oh. Okay. All right. I'm excited. I feel like it's actually gonna taste good. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Okay. You're just gonna use that to crush it? I think Can so. I do it? Yes. Okay, okay. So this is literally gonna be our dough. Do they have this in prison? Oh! I'm just <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Woo! Oh. You wanna do the other side? How like crushed do we get it? Till it looks powdery. Guys, drop a like on this video right now if you missed Jessica in the videos. I love filming with her, but you know, like, we're just busy. All right, you know what? This is good enough. Because we gotta add 
Okay, so next up, I think it's the boiling Hot water, water, right? Do you want to put this in the microwave? This might sound really stupid, but does anybody else get really scared of putting things in the microwave like they're going to explode? I do. I, I was literally just going to ask you, is it safe to put glass in the microwave? We're going to get attacked by microwave lovers that <laughs> know everything about a microwave. Okay. Okay, so uh, how long? I would say 30 seconds at a time. <laughs> yes, it is hot. Stop. We gotta add a little bit of water, not too much. You want me to do it, Jessica? Yeah, bro. <laughs> okay. okay I'll, I'll hold this open. Here it goes. Try everything. not to miss. <laughs> <laughs> Are you serious? I'm scared. It's boiling. Oh. Are you? Oh, that's okay. a lot. That's a lot. Okay. Oh so my God. Now, I just—I already messed up the freaking pizza, man. I think we're on the right track yes. here. It's already looking like it's pumping together. Yeah. I think we're supposed to do this for about 15 minutes. Same as the burrito, you're gonna cut some Slim Jim or beef jerky, whatever you want. And then you're gonna cut your pickles. Jessica, Jessica, watch out, watch out. <laughs> it's like, because it's slippery, the Slim Jim. Oh, wow. Not a huge fan of the pickles. What about you? Uh, it depends. Okay, so we got the dough ready. We got these sliced up. We're gonna need them later. You're gonna put this on any circular thing. We just chose a container top. Hey, now that does look like dough. I think we crushed that part. So then you put a piece of saran wrap on top of it. That way your hands don't get stuck to it. And then you start kneading and forming it in the shape, in the of, shape the of the circle. Okay. Stop repeating that, hey, come on. <laughs> I'm kidding. We're cousins. <laughs> We're family, we do this. All right? We're allowed to do this. <laughs> Are you ready? Hey! What? Oh, yeah. This is like Sweet Life is Zach and Cody. No, it's, it's not. not. Hey! Oh! Stop, stop, you're doing that. No, you're weird. <laughs> Wait, how, are you being serious? How did that just happen? Stop, the dough is getting cold. We gotta get to the this, dough man. Never warm. Wow, here we go, here we go. Hey! Ooh, that actually fire. looks like his in the video. Mm -hmm. So we did a good job for sure. I wish YouTube had a feature where they could smell like what we're smelling. You know what right? I mean? Like, That'd be smart. Maybe in the future? Yeah. We could create it. Guys, don't steal that. We said it today. He said about two minutes. So oh, we're gonna wow. place this in here. And. Our dough, Whoa. our dough. Is it hot? Um, yeah. Oh, dude, it actually came together as Yo, one. Whoa, this is sick. So now we got our salsa as our pizza sauce. It's a little strange. But... Oh, that's good. Oh. I am so freaking. It's okay, nothing going I on. am so sorry. I am just so. Hey! I am just sometimes not the brightest fish in the sea. This part is a little weird to me. Like it was going well, and then now I'm a little scared. But salsa is good. It, it smells, smells good. good. It, smells it actually good. smells good. So put okay. it around a bit. You get your pepperoni and beef sticks in this bowl, and then you're gonna add some cheese. You like cheese, right? Yes, Brian. I love cheese, guys. <laughs> like I'm lactose too. Really? But, so now you're gonna put this on your pizza. Ooh, hold up. D might have did All something. Right. <laughs> now we're gonna put this back in the microwave two minutes. for two more minutes, and then we should be good. Here we go. Wait, wait, wait. Where's your hat? Oh, guys, listen. No, I, I'm no, sure no, you got. No, 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 you guys got the gist of it. No, no, no. There we go. Get her like a spirit. sailor. Whoa, this actually looks like a pizza. Ooh. Whoa. Honestly, everything about it sounds good. The only things I'm worried about was the salsa and the pickles now. All right, Brian, sprinkle her up with some pickles. Okay. I wish they were mm -hmm. banana peppers, because, like, I love banana peppers. Do you want banana peppers? No. Okay. Because that's not how he did it. Oh, okay. All right, we gotta cut it into slices now. Whoa! Honestly, presentation-wise, I think this is a 10 out of 10. I, I would say the same. All okay. right, guys, the moment of truth. Prison pizza, baby. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Yo. Mm. Yo. We might have just did something. This is actually good. This mm -hmm. is a 10 out of 10. I'm a fan. Wait, I'm wait, going wait. in for a second. Hold on, hold on, wait for me. Wow, G. Oh. I thought he was waiting for a second bite. <laughs> Even the pickles are good on it. 10 out of 10. Thank you guys so much for watching. I had a lot of fun making these prison foods and honestly, they're pretty creative. Yeah. I'll give them that, like a 10 out of 10 for the creativity. Some of them were iffy, some of them were pretty good. So drop a like, hit that subscribe button, get me to 20 mil. And other than that, it's been Rug. And, and we're out. Peace. I up in that Lambo. I'm so hot, I need a fan on. In Diego in the sand, oh. Walk around in Gucci sandals. Gucci. G Wagon, I pull up like skirt. And I put that Louis B on my shirt. Shaking down me, cause I know.